ladies and gentlemen, we are coming off of complete disaster <laughs> in the last episode of Below the Stone. Uh, we ended up real fricked up by the game, uh, and I am not trying to be fricked up by the game today. We are taking a super, super simple mission. Um, and the only goal of this mission is not to go deep, okay? Um, it's hopefully going to be a quick mission where I mainly want to collect, like, I want to get a stack of mushrooms, I want to get a stack of glow lads, and I want to get some iron, um, and, and coal. You know, basic, basic resources, nothing, nothing overly crazy, nothing overly intense, um, I just want us to kind of prepare a tiny bit for then, uh, a future future run that we'll do directly after this uh where we attempt to go a little deeper once more but i i need to get some iron in order to make proper equipment and get us back to kind of the the state we were in before because we were very clearly not all that prepared and and ready for uh for the the super deep areas of the game uh, and apparently there's there's even deeper <laughs> from what people have said. So uh, I kind of have a general clue of, of what we, we should be doing here. But I want to get a, a basic, kind of basic mission out of the way. Um, hopefully get a little bit of loot out of it uh, when we get back and, and just gear us up for some success. Uh, but that's going to require me getting some iron. It's, it's really, it all boils down to getting iron. Uh, cause copper, copper armor just ain't gonna cut it, and, and a copper pickaxe is not gonna cut it. We may have to deal with the copper armor part, uh, but we need to get enough iron for a, uh, an iron pick. Just because there's certain ore that I, I just can't get, and when you explore deep, there's like no reason to go deep if you can't get the resources down there anyway in the, the form of the ore. So we're going to do what we can. Um, give me give me the potatoes in my inventory. Frankly, I should just eat them. Uh, I'm going to eat a singular one of them that may make you mad. You may go, Tyler, you should be popping all of them. You're not at full. But this way now, we will, we will build a spot in the inventory for potatoes. Um, and that way, they will just cycle into that spot. And I don't have to worry about going and finding them in my inventory. And being at 90 health, it, the easiest part of the dungeon is not really a concern for me. Okay? I, I feel fine about this. I was able to craft a, a new crossbow for us. I thought that that was a pretty, pretty important uh, thing for us to recraft. Just because uh, having a little bit of range damage in some of these dungeons and things like that. If we find a dungeon, I'd be happy to do it. But... I'm telling you, I really do not intend on spending a whole hell of a lot of time down here. I, I want to uh, get in, get out, get her done, and then go into a, a legit one. I just haven't found any any damn iron. A little bit, a little bit of copper in here. That's fine. I mean, we we take the copper. I could just dig down, which granted probably a terrible idea but it would it would at least give me a chance to find the dungeon or something that that could have you know you, you can get iron from the walls for sure but you can also just get it uh as a drop in a dungeon which may be a more effective way for us to to pull it off 12 glow glow lichen is not not amazing either i really wanted to get a glow potion i have like 20 something back at the base so the 12 may be enough for us to make the potion. It's just 10 minutes of, of light is is very nice. <laughs> it's a very nice thing to have in, in this game. Okay, there's all my tin. Um, I'm telling you, I, I really am of the opinion we should, we should just call the escape pod soon. I, I'm going to dig down until we reach an opening. Um, and then I, I may call the pod. We'll defend it, we'll get we'll get out, we'll get back. You know, we lost our blunderbuss, which is an unfortunate one. Because that was a, a nice weapon to have when we got down there. This is now a little deeper for sure. But it's just copper. I I really iron is 
the key to our success. A lot of glow, though. I'm, I'm gonna continue to pop the glow. Hello, friend. Go away. The guano is not too important, although it can uh, can give us TNT, which I do think is is almost more valuable offensively than it is uh, for for mining, just because it'll it'll absolutely nuke an enemy. Okay. We also need to be careful because I don't know if our escape pod is going to be tougher since we we went deeper. I don't actually know how that works. Um, give me some potatoes. We basically have no armor on right now, which is why we're, we're when we're getting hit, we're getting absolutely smacked around. <laughs> you, you need not be concerned. Um, I just ate that straight to the head. I mean, all of these straight to the head. This this is actually a good reason to not try to find a dungeon, man. Like, I'm, I'm not going to be well fit to handle a dungeon. I, I should... Caught. Who the hell are you? <laughs> okay. This is a new one. Hello. Talk. A mole? Mole. It's looking at me with anticipation. Sniff. Okay. Um. Mole goggles. I mean, I would freaking love some mole goggles, but I need I need uh, stone for that, or I need iron for that. That's tough. Um. It's super cheap crossbow bolts for what it's worth. Uh, oh, never mind. It's not. It's not cheap at all. <laughs> it's one for for five tin. That's a horrible deal. Yeah, and and one torch for five five coal is a horrible deal too. Okay. Um. Well, you're interesting. I'll give you that. There's some iron over here, which is very so valuable. It's not iron, frick. It's silver. Thought that was my iron man. Not my Iron Man, as in Tony Stark, but you get what I'm saying. Uh, okay. Kill you. Just just try not to take too much damage here. I know immediately I, I have taken three damage in this scenario. I just want to make sure I'm going to clear out some of, the, some of the, the, the green lads around here. It's really not a ton of them. Okay, frick this. <laughs> I'm just going to do... A little bit of this action because every bolt kill oh frick me getting stuck on rocks the these big rocks are they're the biggest way you can die <laughs> i swear you get trapped on a on a stone and then everything goes downhill hello friend okay we're going to get out of here right now i'm i'm cutting my losses on the bright side, we get a little bit more copper. Um, yeah, just just can't just can't mine you. God, it sucks. I really just like a tiny bit of iron would go so hard. It would go so hard. The the 18 glow. You got more tin here. It's so largely irrelevant. I mean, maybe you could find. I, I'm not sure what you're finding, brother. That's gonna give you iron. I mean, we're, we're kind of, I think we, we have seen most of what there is to see at this point without us going much, much deeper. I think the iron may just be deeper, man. Like that, that's the biggest issue. Okay, do this. It's a really deep cave-in, so this, this could actually reveal a lot of resources. Um, bunch of coal, some fossils, some copper. Largely irrelevant. Okay, largely irrelevant. Good chunk of coal, though. Coal, coal, still valuable. Always, always gonna be needed. Here, I'll mine down. It's just copper, man. It's just copper as far as the eye can see. I, I think you, I think you gotta call it. Okay, I think you gotta call it. I'm very intrigued by the idea of calling the silo in a wall, though. Because what if, what if we uh, had to defend just like one little alleyway of stuff coming down? That actually sounds miserable now that I say it out loud. I think that would be an absolutely uh, ridiculously terrible idea. Okay. No iron in the walls. Tough. Very, very tough. Um, let's, let's call ya. Okay, Let, let's call ya. This is my previous, uh, previous thing. Okay, it's down here. You've cleared out an area. 
I think this is a terrible idea. I think it's a terrible idea, but I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do what I can. What I should do is is use my my I brought my my thingy in to see if maybe that would be that would be useful for us to find a cave. It did find the cave, but it's uh, a decent decent chunk away. Or we already found it, one of the two. It could be a little little column A, little column B on that one. Okay, thank you, thank you. You're you're doing you're doing fine. You're doing so fine. 84 84 99 100. Okay. Um I mean, we we theoretically leave. <laughs> it's actually an interesting idea to uh, pop the thing down, but then keep exploring. I'm gonna leave though. We're hoping that one of our uh, yeah, I mean, we we completed the challenge, so 213 gold. We we might be able to buy something, or maybe the the chests have iron. It's a bunch of coal. It's actually some sapphire and 200 gold. Um. Okay, take a look here. You should be able to craft a glow potion. No health potions, though. That's tough. <laughs> that one's a little bit rough. Um, what about in here? Dynamite. Health potions. I guess I can buy two of those. Let's buy a little dynamite. That's all of our money. We, we can sell the fossils. The sapphire shards go for actually a, a decent chunk. Wood goes for a decent chunk. Selling all that tin don't don't do a whole lot for me. Um, okay, I will sell. Well, I'm gonna keep the sapphire. I'll sell these though. Let, let's drop off some stuff and then we're gonna go right back down, man. Um, I do think I'm gonna maybe craft some copper armor though, just because it's a, it's a little eh. Our, our situation so give me 32 bolts we got dynamite we got health potions 36 mushrooms we we need those stupid flowers is what we need Th those are the the way to get our crafting our own health potions but then you i suppose i should do a bone shaman helmet since this is yeah that's that's better resistance than this we'll drop you off and then copper chest plate copper gloves copper helmet and yeah, we just we just don't have iron. I would love I would love to have it, but we just don't. Oh yeah, I can't take that, man. I need copper shoulders because that goes on there. Okay, yeah, I mean the copper helmet largely irrelevant now that I kind of sit here and, and take a look at it. I wonder if I could sell it back and at least get some value from it. How how much does a, a copper helmet go for? It's probably like ten. <laughs> it's exactly ten. Frick me. That's actually like a horrific value. Very, very bad. But that's okay. That's okay. Um, we will come over here. Drop you off. Any food? 48 potatoes. I'll take 24 down. And then we'll go. And and my plan is... Um, these will all happen with ease. We're going to travel far left. Okay, I'm just going to mine to the left immediately. We have really not done much exploring left. I I don't care about this. Okay, we have not done much exploring left. Let's just head left. Interestingly, we're actually starting in a, a different biome than than we typically do, which is intriguing. Um, not sure that it matters much to me. But it is intriguing. Okay. Um, I will never turn down mining coal. I'm telling you, I'm a I'm a minecrafter at heart. You you never you never turn down coal. Coal is it's a it's a good resource to have. You you always need well, you don't need coal in Minecraft in the late game, to be fair. You can just make charcoal. Automated farm. Okay, I, look. In the early game you always take coal. The end. And I'm gonna I'm gonna take coal because last I checked. There's no solid way for me to make charcoal in this game. Um, I'm getting absolutely obliterated out the get-go. Why the hell did I take so much damage, man? Really feels like something something went haywire. This is a dungeon, actually. I, I would like to come in here, but I am going to pop a potato or two. 
Okay, hello. This is a, a really nasty dungeon out the get-go, man. Okay. You gotta... I mean, you gotta just just send it, I guess. I, I, don't, I don't know what to do here. I'm gonna toss a TNT over to this to blow it up. You, you have to... I'm gonna die. I'm dead. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest. That's, that's a tough one. Um, wow, we lose... I mean, just effectively everything. Um, give me a copper pickaxe. Wow, it's, it's real bad. It's real bad. I am going to craft all of this again. Um... Give me a copper axe instead of a copper sword. Maybe that's the the ticket here. Give me all this. And then uh, give me... Give me this into here. Oh, sure, I'll take a disposable rock radar. We'll grab this. I'm going, I'm going right back down, man. God, losing the glow potion is so much pain. That's so much pain and suffering. What the hell, dude? Okay, give me this. Throw this all in the trash. It, it does not matter. I I will go back in. I'm not sure we're accomplishing much today. Nine bats, green slimes. All of those are, are fine. I have, like, nothing to my name. I don't have a crossbow. I should not do anything crazy. I mean, it's actually, like, a horrible idea to, to do much of anything, uh... Exploration wise on this one, I should just get in, get out. The axe is decent damage, but slower swinging. But I, I know it hits more people, which is probably better for the slimes. Yeah, because I can knock out multiple of them at once. I do think the slimes are, are kind of my biggest nemesis in this game. They, they just swarm you and then you are in extremely terrible shape once they do that. Okay, let's just go up. You're gonna find good things when you when you dig straight up. It's the exact opposite of digging straight down, right? I suppose digging diagonally up would be the opposite of digging straight down, but you you get the the point. The the other thing that we can do, right, is just do a bunch of small missions, right? And then as you do a bunch of small missions, you're going to get a ton of money that you can then use to just buy your way to success which is maybe a good idea or it's a terrible idea but i i think it's possibly a good idea hello go away got got some skeletons we don't mind the skeletons is that a cave-in no that's coal I, we take coal coal's fine just keep it going. Give me you, give me you, give me you. Let, let all of this beautiful glow shroom go into my inventory. The medium slimes, you, you need eight of these suckers. I'm telling you, I may just leave when we get the, uh, get the goals done. I know I say it pretty much every time, and then I stay in the dungeon way longer than I should. The greed is, uh, it just consumes me. Every second of the day, I do be greeting. Medium slimes, my beloved. The tiniest slimes, the worst though. <laughs> the absolute worst. I think this axe is going to awaken good things in me. You gotta go, brother. Sorry. You, you, you hold valuable resources for me. Okay. Anything going on here? It looked like there was some stuff in the walls, but... Apparently, no. Apparently, no. Okay. We're gonna continue to the left, but I... This is a pretty wide open area. So I think that we can find at least another medium green slime lad. We're looking for more bats. Tin is just irrelevant. I don't even know why I'm still mining it. Copper, however, since I keep on dying, is... Very relevant. It's very relevant because it's going to result in me, uh, every time I die, I'm, I'm remaking with copper because we just don't have, we don't have the excess iron. 
Okay, now what is going on over here? Is this a, a different biome or, or just a, a green lad vibing? Sure, sure looks like a, a funky biome. We have not been here. Um, oh, great. It's a slime biome. I'm sure this is going to be a lovely place. <laughs> okay. Um, well. That's fine. I, I can... I can mess with this. I hate it. Don't get it twisted. I hate it. But we, we gotta deal with it. Maybe there's something for me to find in here of value. So far, it's just a very tiny spot. Yeah, honestly, there's like nothing here. Unless, I wonder if the walls have anything. No, it's just a, a slime infested area with a lot of slimes. Okay. That's, that's fine. That's fine. Better than a whole biome that I want to dig my eyes out with a rusty fork in because I'm getting swarmed by slimes the whole time. I guess I'll, I'll continue this way. Any any pathway up is a good path for me. And we do have to regen all of our uh, all of our greens we've been missing. Here's a dungeon. Again, I do think that it's probably a terrible idea to, to do these dungeons given my somewhat crappy armor and in general not well put together build that I have. I don't have any weapons, I don't have, I mean, I, I basically am running naked through here in, in a lot of ways. It's not horribly naked, but it's naked enough. Okay, hello. Get destroyed, you too. Okay. We're looking for iron in some of these chests. I actually don't mind the food. I should probably use some of the food. <laughs> Speaking from uh, experience of dying repeatedly, food food pretty good, right? Food pretty good. Okay. It is a cobalt dungeon, which is, I think, better than a skeleton dungeon. The skeleton dungeons are very rough. The cobalt dungeons, they, they don't bother me as much. Now there are skeletons here, and there's slimes. The whole party's here, and I'm going to die. Okay. You're you're taking damage. You you gotta you gotta obviously back up a little bit, Tyler. Pop pop some mushrooms. This is all you can do. Yike. Yike. Don't got no food, huh? Just just consume a little bit. This is actually a huge dungeon. Maybe there's something in this chest. Throwing axes. Okay, time to mess around. Let's do it. Are you pathfinding to me? Yeah, you are. And then immediately hitting me. Very rude. Okay, throwing axe. Yeah, it's effective. You, you can launch it from, from pretty far away, which is cool. What the hell is this? Linen resistance. Stay warm below the stone. It's a four banger. I mean, it's the same as what I have. Holy frick. We found the mother load. Oh, what the hell? Okay, you got me. Congrats. Uh, I had the opportunity to get a, a chest with a, a gold key, and I just destroyed it. If I get a key here, I am going to cry. I am going to cry. Okay, so now we know... Now we know that the, the gold chests are what we need keys for, which we did not know previously. So that's, that's good intel, I think. We're actually getting some unique loot in here, which I I can appreciate. I just now would like to uh, like to find a path. Is this this connects? Okay, hello. Get destroyed. Get destroyed. There's still chests to be had. Oh, my key! <laughs> my gold key. I wonder, it looked bugged, man, to where the chest was still there. I'm gonna try to still open it. <laughs> I'm gonna try to still open it. Maybe maybe the game will feel sorry for me and give me the loot that's in this, even though I, I accidentally destroyed it. Uh, hey! You gave me a shotgun? The cave sweeper. 
I don't know what bullets go into that. Okay, th clearly there's something buggy there. Um, I'm sure they'll fix it. We, we profit from the bug in this scenario, so I'm going to not complain about it. Uh, I'm an idiot. Just pop my just pop my thing that that we really did not need to pop. You know what? We we come out of this in decent shape though. I I should probably now exfil and get out of here since we have like a, a legendary loot piece. <laughs> that seems like a very intelligent idea. I mean, if we're running around with a shotgun in here, I should probably like get out immediately, right? Be very intelligent to leave. I'm saying all of this, and we all know that I'm going to continue to explore. At least until I get my, my bats, right? Because the, the bats are... Bats are going to provide me... I mean, th that extra chest. It's legendary loot. I mean, it can be anything, right? It's the same as the chest we just opened. I suppose. It's just most of the time it's, it's trash what we get out of it. So I, I feel less enthralled with the idea but i i know that it's what i should do and there's bats in this cave system all the time so i think it's it's gonna be worth it it's gonna be worth it we we just find some bats everything goes cherry and sundays i don't know what the oh you know what dude i know what the bullets are for the shotgun we have bullets we have them in our our system back in the, in the bank vault back at the base so we're we're fine. Let let's let's exfil this shotgun out of here so that we have it. But I am going to get the bats, okay? Cause we're we're not we ain't in the camp of doing less missions. Okay, I hate a spider biome. <laughs> spider biome is a great way for us to die. Um I mean, we're gonna do it though, all right? We're gonna do it. Can't really, can't really just not. I mean, I suppose we could go around, but they got loot. I mean, they do got loot in them. We're going pretty high up. I mean, maybe, maybe you got some good stuff up here. More copper, we don't mind. We're actually only at 16. We did find a bunch of gold, man, which is interesting. Uh, I suppose I could maybe try to craft some gold ingots and then either sell them. I, I find it hard to believe that, that gold tools are all that good. I have a feeling the gold is, is just needed as a, as a valuable monetary resource. Frick you, you little stupid skeleton. Okay, we, we are now in full-blown spider hell. And that's okay, um... The nice part about spider biome is bones, actually. Oh, no. Bone, bones are good for getting... Uh, there's that shaman helmet that, that's a five-banger for resistance. It's really, really solid. I think that probably worth it for us to, to get that... Get some bones out of here. Especially, it's it's not... It's not a horrible biome, I suppose. Um, with the axe, we're we're gonna be fine. I would I, I really like a ranged weapon when we're doing spiders, though. Just because they 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 uh, hit me at range. We got more gold, man. Okay, skeletons inside of these uh, structures. Hate that. <laughs> Hate that with a, a fervent passion. Got some some dwarven stout. I'm just gonna pop you real quick. Suppose I probably should heal. It's getting a little spicy on on the health. Just take care of business. 75 health. A little bit more copper. Copper is just more more armor we we build up in the future. We don't mind. Copper everywhere the eye can see. Can't help but notice that we haven't found any iron. We continue to just... Iron, iron is a, a myth in this game. Very hard to find. And uh, no rhyme or reason to where it exists. Hello, spiders. Cobalt, son. Okay. 
I respect it. You've thrown your three. This is this is a, a cobalt camp. I hate that actually. Okay. Try try to at least you you have to destroy the camp. Okay. Destroy the camp. Very good. There is sometimes good loot in these camps, so I am going to uh, do what I can. You guys are trapped in the damn wall. Okay. It's a bunch of pots around here is the, the value. Cobalt head actually fairly valuable too. I think another one spawned. Where are you? You're over here. Love that for me. I love you guys being stuck in walls. That's a... Uh, <laughs> we've had some, some kind of buggy uh, buggy stuff today. But it's an early access game. So it happens. I think we maybe got a little bit of iron. I have one iron. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we're so back. <laughs> We've never been more back than this here. Okay, you guys are still alive, huh? Okay, there we go. I think we have now plundered the whole camp. Feeling a little hurt, okay? A little, little bit of pain. Not horrible. Absolutely not horrible. Again, I think that you're in a position. You, you kill a couple bats and you get the hell out. We, we are not in an exploratory uh, world at this point. It's more of a uh, just kind of sad, sick, and twisted world. Mr. Cobalt, you were lost as hell. My guy had no great back in here, huh? It's a huge spider area. I'm still trying to figure out. I, I think that biomes... You can kind of expect biomes at certain levels. But what I, I don't understand is if they're always in the same locations or not. Like, if I came up here every time, will I always see a, a spider biome? It'll obviously be, like, slightly different. I, I don't think that that cobalt camp will be there every time. But we can see spiders every time around here. You know, negative 83, 300. I am going to drop these. Those you get from slimes, I'm not worried about that. That is iron. Okay. Very good. Obviously fantastic. Being able to exfil and get a little iron out of here would be an absolutely monumentally good scenario. You guys are just being annoying. We're getting a lot of spider eggs uh, and things like that. Which is fine too. Not not huge value, but good enough. I'm gonna pop one of these just because this area is there's there's a lot of things, and I just want to make sure that I don't get surprised by any of said things. 44 bones too. I'm telling you, that's actually pretty pretty decent. The bone shaman helmet. I mean, frankly, I I need to craft a bone shaman helmet right now. I don't even have one. So all of these bones, we, we could theoretically get one and a spare, which would be, that'd be really good. We don't need the miner helmet. Like, I'm, I'm starting to, I'm starting to kind of like the, uh, like the spider caves, just, just to get all of this stuff. It's free arrows. That's just a rusty pickaxe. We don't really care about the rusty, but we're, we're getting spider eggs and, and, all the things. Arrows, ore occasionally. Spider legs as well. And some of this stuff I barely know what it does. There's 64 bones now. So really no huge incentive for me to keep doing this. I think in a perfect world, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to get out of here. Yeah. This is a good biome for me to be in. Now you just want bats. I'm gonna hope that none of them are following me. I think that they they likely are. Cave carrots. You know what? This food. This is actually a really good situation. Um. So many spider eggs. These torches are largely irrelevant. Give me the potato. There's a bat. Okay. Very good. More mushrooms as well. We need the heal. Okay. Place down a couple torches. 
Look at the value in this area. The torches actually do light up the place, like, a lot. <laughs> in some ways, even more than the glow shrooms do. So that's that's probably a good idea to, to bring torches with us here and there. There's a lot of ore in this area. Just, just take care of it. You got copper, you got tin. I don't know if I'm even collecting tin. Actually, I have a stack of tin, so never mind. That might, that might be iron, actually. That is iron. Dude, huge. Absolutely massive. This has turned out to be a very, very good expedition. After, after some, some disaster here. This one is looking nice. 55 health. I know you're like, Tyler. Just pop the, just pop the damn mushrooms. It's probably intelligent. Two bats. Two bats, we're out, dude. We're out. I don't I don't need to mess around here uh, any longer. Very perfectly content collecting a little bit more iron. <laughs> very, very content collecting a little bit more iron and then GTFO. Although, clearly this area has iron, so I wonder if this is a, a good opportunity for us to... Uh, I mean, may maybe you just look around a tiny bit more... I don't want to dip into a different biome, though, because clearly this biome... Yeah, this biome is where the iron is. We got more here. 64 iron would be... I mean, it would it would be game-changing for us. Look at this vein. We love it. We love it. Okay. Up to 24 iron. <laughs> it's not a lot, okay? It's not a lot. Glow caps seem useful. Blue caps, less useful. The fossils are completely worthless. They, they just sell, to be honest. Which, don't get me wrong, I, the money is good. But I think I care a little bit more about resources than I do money. Although money buys resources, so... Riddle me that one, Batman. More iron. There's honestly... There, there's a th part of me that's like, just, just go in the walls, right? Just go in the walls. Anywhere you, you see something sparkling, just just go in. Seems that there's a decent chance it's iron right now. God, that's silver. Silver, less intrigued with. I can't even get it, so very less intrigued. More copper. You're gonna be stacking, yeah, you're almost up to 64 copper. 33 iron is enough for a pickaxe, and I think that's really all that I care about. That's not iron, but this is. Okay. That's just tin. This is just copper. I'm just Ken. Everywhere else I'd be a 10. Kill you. And... Okay. I'm good. I'm good. Call the escape pod. Uh, you put it in an area that is nowhere near me. We love that for me. Break this for, for even more iron. Holy iron, dude. That's incredible. And you guys are just mining for me. That's actually an interesting way to uh, to handle this. We, By having these guys spawn, they're just mining the area for me. Okay. On the bright side, I think I have found a weapon in my copper axe. And I think that possibly an iron axe would be a good idea too. But the iron pickaxe is the number one priority when we get out. I think we're in good shape, okay? Um, just just for, like, the future, we're in good shape. We, we now have a somewhat distinct strategy uh, to, to handle loads of enemies with, with our axe. There's actually some pots down there. We're, we're going to explore that here in a second. I'm taking some damage. I'm, I'm not that concerned, okay? What's going on here? Uh, got, got a ruins, actually. I mean, look, I'm a simple guy. I am going to explore said ruins. Not too worried about the copper. But how how could I not explore some ruins? Especially when there's irons right next to it. Thank you, thank you. The guano is largely irrelevant. And I think that potentially there was more copper up here. Yeah, I mean... Look, it's, it's, I got two stacks of copper. This is this is likely not not needed, especially when I don't even have that much coal 
I mean, we, we can't even smelt all this copper. But I'm, I'm still going to collect it. It's fine. Is that an apple? Yeah, it is. An apple. <laughs> okay. One a day keeps the doctor away. Eh, it goes for ten. I mean, it's not, it's not bad at all. Really quite good. Okay, it's another camp. This is not what I expected to be here, if I'm perfectly honest with you. You're trying to run away from me? Hey, you guys really just made your home inside of a, a huge ruins? Not not needed, okay? Not needed. We, we should just leave. But I I suppose I'll I'll mess around here. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I should probably just go. There's there's no reason to clear this. Even even uh you you're not getting much out of this. Well, you're getting more iron. <laughs> it's total greed to be honest. 64 iron is so massive though, man. It's so massive. Drop the bolts, give me the iron. These guys should all be squared away now. Honestly, 7 tin for uh for a little uh thingy. Oh, what the heck, man? We found their like we found their home. This, this is this is where all the kobolds live is Cobalt Haven up here. And, and frankly, I should get out. <laughs> I should get out. I'm starting to take damage and things are going to get Things are going to get spicy. It's another apple. Don't get it twisted. Apple's good. But do you know what else is good? Leaving. <laughs> Leaving sounds like a very good thing to do. Goodbye. I'm out. Sayonara. See you later. Give me that coal. I'm leaving. No reason to be here. I am overstayed my welcome. Goodbye. Y'all were probably freaking out as I'm sitting at 25 health in there. As a good exfil, to be honest, um, decent chunk of gold, 145. Uh, you're gonna get another 200 from that bag. And then whatever is in the super chest. This is just more copper. This is... Is that emerald? I don't believe we actually have emerald. Yeah, it's emerald. Okay. Here, we're going to spend money to get ourselves another slot in here. Just kidding. Apparently, we won't be doing that. Dump everything you can into here. Boy, we really got no gold, huh? Okay. Wow, still a lot of stuff in inventory. We are going to try to sell some of this, because, like, these heads go for a ton. This I don't really need. Wow, Cave Sweeper really does not go for much, huh? Th those... Eh, those are pretty good. Ghost Veil... Um, okay. I'll sell you for 98. And then... Can I make any potions? Glow potion, average. Health potion, average. Health potion, minor. You can actually make another one of these. Huge. We're gonna- we're gonna put one of you in the- the bank, though. 443. I still need more. We do have gold ingots. Let, let's let craft up some of this. Okay. Because um, that'll at least get some stuff out. We, we need a bone shaman helmet. Another one is probably for the better too. But that's going to require even more slots. <laughs> so we'll, we'll get there when we get there. Gold ingot. Sure. Craft. Craft your two. Iron ingot. Craft your, your max of it, please. We need... An iron light axe. Eight damage, huh? It's the same as this, but it swings faster. Or the two-handed iron axe. Eight damage. Swings probably slower, is my guess, but has further reach. I want this one. Okay. We need an iron pick. And then let's get an iron chest plate to go here. 16 resistance, pretty solid. Give me a crossbow. Give me max bolts. I mean, we are we are setting ourselves up for greatness, are we not? 
Give me gloves. Give me a shoulder pad. You're going to go on to there. And then we're going to try to sell some stuff, I think. Because <laughs> we, we need money. How much do these gold ingots sell for? 40? Might have to just do it, okay? You might have to just do it. I mean, crossbow bolts sell for a lot, actually. That's so worth it to do. I'm sorry, they're so cheap to make. Whereas tin is not... Silver actually sells for a lot, too. Could maybe sell some silver. All this copper gear does not sell for much, though. The gold ore I can sell. I mean, we have a lot of copper ore. We can sell some of that. Whoa, this goes for a hundred. That would be my spare one, but it's really easy to get bones, man. I'm going to sell all of this for 364. And then that lines me up. 807, I can buy another area in here. We're going to bring shotgun shells with us because now we have our shotgun we're gonna bring well i really don't need the crossbow anymore i suppose this is going to go here your iron pick goes here all of your copper gear you're not using and then this and this is what we would run in with next time i think that's fine i really do i think that's completely fine we need to find a better solution to money um as time goes on or else we're going to be a little bit a little bit behind for sure, but I don't mind this. I think we're in good shape. That's gonna do it for this episode. Next episode, we go deep. We go, we go real freaking deep, okay? Um, I'm going to a corner, and we're gonna see what happens. Uh, probably top right corner, because we haven't really explored that way. But for now, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, like on the video, much appreciated. See you in the next one. Goodbye.